Why, hello everyone, it's me, LeBron James, um, with the Miami Heat. What? This video's not that old, you see what I did? Okay. All right, so today's problem is which expression is not equivalent to the other expressions? Not, I like how they all caps it, like they're screaming at you, like, which expression is not equivalent to the other expressions? <laughs> oh, drink your tea? That's how math people are. Okay, so give it a shot, pause it, and then resume, we'll see if you got it right. Okay, welcome back. All right, so we're looking at these four, and apparently three of them are the exact same thing, which is crazy that they can like vary them enough to do that, and then the other one's different. So we're trying to figure out, figure out which one's different, okay? So uh, let's see what we can reduce, okay? Um, we got 4x to the fourth y squared. We can't really make that one any smaller than it is, okay? This one we can distribute, so we'll do that here in a second. All right, and then we've got 16x to the fourth y squared. We can't really reduce that one either, so that one's gonna stay as it is as well. All right, and this last one, you've got four squared, so we know we can simplify it a little bit, okay? So all these, this one, this one, and this one all have like x to the fourth y squared. So we know these three are cool in that part, but the regular numbers look like they're gonna vary. All right, let's do this d first. So we got four squared x to the fourth y squared. So that squared is just attached to the four. You see how it's like right next to the four? There's no parentheses or anything like that. It's just attached to the four. So four squared, which four times four is 16. Okay, so this problem is the same as this, which means it's also the same as this. So it looks like these two are chilling, which would make me think that this one was wrong because we can't simplify and get something different. But let's work this one just to make sure, shall we? Sure, we shall. <laughs> okay, um, squared. Okay, now this one's a little different because that, that squared, that two, that exponent two is on the outside. So that means you have to distribute. Anytime you've got something that's got the parentheses, you distribute to everything. So it goes there, there, and there. So let's go ahead and work this. So four times four is 16. You got x squared times two. Now, when you multiply these, um, you really just add, okay? So whenever you're multiplying exponents, instead of you doing like, like say this was five and this was two, instead of it being like five times two is 10, instead of doing that, you don't multiply them. You multiply numbers, exponents, you add them. Like two x squared squared, so you just add them. So it'd be x to the fourth. They like collect variables. And then y, it's sitting with none of them up there, so boom, put it there. Um, I think I did that right. It feels right. It's been a while since so I've done exponent multiplication, but I'm pretty sure, yeah, yeah, you would add them in there. Yeah, that's right. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, maybe multiply them. I don't know. If you figure it out, tell me in the comments. It's been a while since so I've done it, and I don't want to look it up right now because you're, like, trying to get back to class. So, uh... We do know that these three are all the same, and this one's wrong. So you're like, well, I can't circle all three. You shouldn't. It says, which is not. So this is actually our correct answer, and you're wrong, you're wrong, you're wrong, because you're all right. <laughs> this problem was confusing. In the comments, tell me your favorite TV show to watch on Netflix. I'm really looking for something fun, and all this red's making me think of Netflix. Thanks for joining. If you could, please subscribe. That'd be great, like legit great. Um, I, you know what, comment in here that you subscribe. That means a lot. I got more stuff over at tarveracademy.com and then at Tyler Tarver is me on Instagram. So, peace. Bye bye. Hey, it's me, Sonic the Hedgehog. I want to let you know that if you click that little circle to subscribe, then uh, we're going to send you $2 million in the mail. You just got to go to the bank and pay for it. Subscribe. <laughs> I don't know.